Well, off of that 180 there from Danny Baggish. Welcome back to the Booyah Cup finale. This is our fourth place match on the men's Booyah Cup. Mike Maloney, Danny Baggish. I know Danny was wanting this bad boy. I'm Sean Green, joined by Will Stewart. Yeah, sorry for the little delay here. We were trying to figure out exactly the order we were going. I wanted to make sure that they weren't just going to go one and one and one and one and one, because yeah. then we'd be here for four hours. Yeah. Uh, but it looks like they're going to start playing the third place match here in just a moment's time for the women. Okay. So we'll kind of splash into that one when we can, but this will be our priority, I guess. You guess? Here we go, 81 left for Danny Baggish. Trip 19, double 12. Double 12. Hits it on dart three. And here we go, it already starts, folks. He's yeah, they've been him, uh, talking. Giving him some fist pumps. Yeah, Danny said win or lose. He was, uh, this is the, this is what he wanted. This is what he wanted, folks, was this match right here. All that smack talk for this moment. Here we go. It is a best of nine legs. Right now, 1-0 lead here for Denny Baggish. Mike Maloney starts off with a nine mark. Danny's going to look to match it. Looking up. Closes the 18s as well. Just a reminder, best of nine here for our men on both the losers and the winner's side. Well... Let's see just how thermonuclear Danny's trying to go here. Pretty thermonuclear. Does point the last one. Yeah, solid seven. Well, he can still go ahead and close yeah. out. He's not going to be able to close out everything. I would have been tempted to go back and point a little bit there, but I, I like don't it. mind the move. Yeah. I especially like the double 19. He did that just for you, buddy. He did it just because he could. Danny Baggish looking over the 20s. Ooh. And if he would have hit that, that would have been like... <laughs> you see Olivia Terry yep. step up on the chair <laughs> and just tell Tyler bye. <laughs> yeah. I love it. There go the 18s. Mike going to go back to the 20s to point. Gets the point lead back. 6.25 to 7.0 here in leg number two. David Fadham joining us saying, what a match this is. Yes, you are correct. David, hope you're doing well. Notice you won that DP Texas event yesterday. Kudos to you. Yeah, congratulations. How about this? Uh, loser, this $900. Yeah, the winner will advance to play Kevin Luke. Look at that. Oh, big darts there for Mike Maloney. See some pictures being taken. Danny looked up at the 20s there on dart number three. So here we go, Mike Maloney. Oh, he's asking what match is this? This is the fourth place match. Yep. Yep, so like I said, winner will advance to play Kevin. Uh, the winner of that one will play Leonard Gates. Yep, in our finals. Danny throws in five bulls right there. But Mike's going to get a look at, at this. 22 points ahead. 
You go straight at this on dart one, right? Gotta he does and hits it. There it is. Leg number two goes to Mike Maloney. 5-5-5 five, five, five to a 5-8-3. One to one. Look at this from Danny Baggish. Oh. Starts off with the six. There's a nice five mark there from Mike Maloney. Big last dart. Needed last dart. There go the 19s. Danny not really playing around at all, huh? No, he's not. He thrives off the energy of pressure and entertaining folks, so he loves a little crowd behind this one watching this match. We'll just take a gander there. Yep, yeah, pretty good group. Danny going ahead and pointing a little bit more. Makes it so that Mike has to stay on the 18s the whole time. It gets the point lead back. This is fun, buddy. 633, 6.0. Definitely some great darts being had here. I wouldn't expect anything less. It comes down to this wow. part of the tournament. Danny hits the four mark. Big trip 18 on dart number three. Looking up. Oh. I think that was a little bit uh, too quick there from Maloney on that last dart. I liked it. Oh, trip one. There's big darts there from Danny Baggish. Looks back to try and find his dart. Two big triples. He takes the look. He's, He's still going to take the look. Yep, and he hits it. Wow. Big darts there from Mike Maloney. Interesting move aggressive but it forces Danny to hit here and he will he's looking at it going back yep uh, and the door is open for Maloney yep great first start looking getting 15s hits it big nine mark there from Mike Maloney Wow. Driver's seat to take a 2-1 lead and break the throw of Danny Baggish. This would be a huge shift in momentum towards Maloney. All right. Going straight at it. There's two. There it is. Breaks the throw. As we head back to 01 for leg number four. Two to one lead for Mike Maloney. 6.29 there on the average. It looks like Liz Tyne and Olivia Terry are just getting underway. Their first starts are being thrown. We'll get over there as soon as this one is over. And a nice 137 to start us off for Mike Maloney. Danny looking to start off perfect. Gets a 140 out of it. All 
All right, a little bit of an opening here for Danny. It's a great first art. Yep. He fills it all the way up. 180 there for Danny Baggish. And uh, Mike Maloney would like one of his own to leave 103. And if he can hit here, it'll be the first add a checkout opportunity. Well, it's still first to look at an out. 143 we've seen. Trip 20, trip 17, double 16. What type of pressure will it be under? Liz Tynan does take the first leg off of Olivia Terry. That was fast. That was. It's a 35. Averaging that one for Tynan. All right, Mike Maloney. Not going to do it. So Danny Baggish is going to get a chance to break right back here. And tie it up 2-2. Two to two. Twelve. Bullseye. Hits the double bull. Wow, big. Looks back and gives him a go, too, buddy. Big hit there from Danny. 41.75, 12 darter. 2-2 two, two scoreline. Breaks the throw right back. Maloney goes ahead and gives him a nice high five there. Yep. No, it's all love between these two guys. They're good friends. It's good competitive love. Exactly. Ninety three there from Danny to get started. Let's see if Mike can fill it up. Oh. Oh no. Not what he was looking for there. So here's Danny Baggish. Well, that'll work. A little 134. No big deal. NBD, buddy. 134 to lead 274. Looks like we're quickly approaching the 1,400 viewers mark. We appreciate you tuning in. Just once again, this is your top four of the men's bracket. Third place match for the ladies is going on right now with Liz Tynan up 1-0 on Olivia Terry. Help us out. Let's get to 1,500-plus. What do you say? Absolutely. Help us break a record. A record is 1,650, we'll say. Around something that like block. that. Yeah, some, something like that. So... Here we go, Mike Maloney. If this, is, if this isn't a great statement, Ryan says, Maloney has a lot of movement and is still very consistent. Good match. Yeah. I mean, he's always had a little bit of movement, but it just shows that practice, 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 your throw is your throw, and if it's on, it's on. Well, and a lot of his movement happens after he releases the dart. Mm-hmm. But Danny Baggish tees it up nicely to leave 80. What type of pressure can Mike put on it? Would love another treble. Not going to get it. Not a lot of pressure. Danny might only get one dart at the double, though. That is a fact. We'll see. He, he will can... only get one dart at a double. Tops. And he misses the one dart at a double. Well, this would be huge. This would be a massive hit if Mike Maloney can take out a nice 1-6-4 here and bag his chuckles because he knows this is the kind of stuff that Mike Maloney can do. Yep. There's the first dart. Trip 18. Bullseye. Oh, oh, Dustin Holt calling for wow. it in the background, too. Wow. 
Let's see Baggish give him a little love as he knows that was a big one if he would hit it. And Danny does his job to take a 3-2 to two lead. Gives a subtle look into the camera there as well. <laughs> All right, three to two. Danny Baggish as we head back to cricket. Before we get any further, big shout out to Cosmo Darts for sponsoring this event. We want to thank them. Nice seven mark open there from Mike Maloney. Danny Baggish opening up with a nine. Up three to two. Mike looking to hit one of his own. Get seven. That'll work. Oh, big dart. Big dart there from Danny to close it out. See where Mike looks. Up 46 points. Gonna open up that wedge before going at the 18s. There they go, and back to points. Man, textbook seven. Seven, seven, seven. And he throws in a 7 of his own. He's going to 7.33 to Mike 7.0. This is so appetizing. I'm almost forgetting to look over at Liz and Olivia's match. We'll give you an update on that one here in just a second. Good darts there for Mike Maloney. And takes out the 16s. Man, entertainment. 7.0, 7.33. Ridiculous. He's gone 7.0, 7.0, 7.0, 7.0. It doesn't get more consistent than that. No, it really doesn't. Wow. Now I'm going to look back at the 15s, I believe. Although he could decide to do something different here. He did decide to do something different. Double bowl. We'll keep winning darts in his hand. Takes a deep breath here. Needs five of them, I believe. There's two of them. Needs the double bowl here. For a 4-2 lead. And what a dart this would be. Takes a deep breath. Oh. And he looks disappointed. Mike has a chuckle in the background. Looks like ah. we're headed to a 3-3 three, three here. 3-3 three, three score line. If Mike Maloney hits one bowl. There it is. 6.38 to 6.60 in that leg. These are darts that uh, we just I just don't know how to play, bud. <laughs> Never had to play those darts before. I don't think I have either, my man. I think this is out of my realm as well. I've had some good shots, but not nearly like these guys. All right, 3-3. Three to three. Mike Maloney, Danny Baggish. I love it. It's awesome. Look at this. Looking down. That's Seven an marks. interesting move there, mm -hmm. do you think? I like it. We've seen consistently today 
trip 20, trip 20, trip 20. Not even a hesitation to look down or, or even a look. Yep. Yeah. I think he felt something different there. Maybe it was the way the darts were laying. There goes the 19s. Back up to the 20s and staying. Staying. A little eight mark there from Danny Baggish. <laughs> this is fun. All right, five mark. Picking up the 20s? Yep, it's a trip 20. Yeah, this is in the hands of Baggish right now. He's put himself a good chunk ahead. And with Maloney only averaging a 5.5, only a 5.5, which yeah. is nuts. Yeah, that's what you just said. You said only a 5.5. <laughs> <laughs> Olivia does win a leg there on uh, that board. Let me check the score line here. It is a 2-1 score line in favor of Olivia Terry. Okay. On uh, that third place match. It's a race to four. Yep. Interesting stuff going on there. Here is Mike Maloney. Needs a lot, a lot, a lot of 16s. Not going to get nearly enough of them. See where Danny looks to go. Get rid of the 16s. 15s. And bullseye. Yeah, that'll work. And this is why I said earlier only a 5.5 yeah. because when Danny's pulling this out, you can't do much but sit there and say, okay, well, 5.5 five is usually good enough for most of the time. It's not good enough here. You can see uh, Mike's just like, all right, well, let's go to the next leg. Closes everything out, though. That was kind of nice. And there you go. 6.56. Danny Baggish in that one. Takes a 4-3 to three lead as we will head back to 01. Just so quick, before we do... Quick gander here at this one. Look at this. Great darts there from Olivia Terry. We'll have the first look at the finish there. As here we go. Mike Maloney starting out not as well as he probably would have hoped. See if Danny can take advantage of it. Oh, yeah. How about perfect? And he looked into the camera. You have a little, little brief little peek, peekaboo at us. I think he might be feeling it. He might be feeling it, and uh, he's letting us know he's feeling it. Yeah. Saying, I told you, folks. He wants nothing more than to win this match on a nine darter. <laughs> Trip 20 for Liz to win this leg. Oh, just misses, leaving tops. 87 look for Olivia. If Olivia can hit yep. it, it'll be a 3 1 lead. Danny Baggish stays perfect through six darts. And Mike will not leave a finish. Danny Baggish, 141. Starting on the trip, 20. Oh. Not going to get it. Trip 13. Would have left double 16. Instead puts himself in the driver's seat to win the match. As Mike Maloney looking just to leave a finish here. Does so. Just in case. Danny should get two darts at a double, though, for the match. There it is. Five to three over Mike Maloney. And Woo. Mike 
That was a great match, man. Danny knows it. He feels relieved to get over the line in that yep. one. <laughs> and he lets us know it, too. Look at that. Danny Baggish with the winner-winner chicken dinner.